All right, guys, let's watch this and talk about it after. I saw my daughter hawking pastries on the street. Are you telling me you saw her in that condition and you left her? You left her in that condition. Monica, stop being over dramatic. Listen, she prefers to suffer. She will suffer until she gets to her senses. Then she comes back home and I will give her the rules of life. If you find out something about me and something about my past or anything at all that you're not okay with, does that change your mind about me? Masi, I love you. I don't care how dark your past is. As a matter of fact, I don't want to hear it. Our present and the future we'll have together is all that matters. Mommy, what are you doing here? Young lady! Enough of this nonsense! You're going home with me! Now! Move! Dad, I don't love Alexandra. I have no feelings for him. Please, I beg you. You know, that cost me a lot. Dad, is the major worth my happiness? I don't love Alexandra. I do not have any single feelings for him. I love someone else. I'm in love with someone else. You might see him as ordinary, but he's the only one that makes me happy. How long are you going to avoid me? For as long as I can. Please, I am, I am so sorry. Please forgive me. You lied to me. I didn't. We really didn't talk about my family. Are you serious? Do we have to talk about your family before you tell me who you are? You see this girl right here? She's not a girl I fell in love with. All right, guys. So let's talk about this one, Stolen Heart. As always, the link to the movie is at the disc in the description. So please, if you've not seen it, go and watch it. Now, this is interesting and it's uh, something that I've always addressed. Uh, I think I've addressed this in the past. That has to be with being honest from the onset of a relationship. Now, you know, I know a lot of people hide their identity for different reasons or they decide to keep things away from their partner because they are trying to present themselves as the perfect uh, individual. Uh, but the truth is that these things, you know, it's always going to come out. It's always going to come out and later on down the line, when it does come out, it's going to create a rift between you and the person because somehow you have betrayed that trust that they know you, the trust that they know everything about you, that you've told them everything. You know, I 100% understand when people tend to say that, you know, I couldn't tell him this because of this, or I couldn't tell her that because of the other thing, you know, but you see that thing that you're hiding, in most cases, is like pregnancy. It's going to let her show. Um, if it's something that's not going to show, then of course, maybe there's not even any reason to talk about it. But believe me most of these things show it's always better to tell them because one day something is going to cross paths with your life and whatever you are hiding will pop up so please ladies please gentlemen you know when you start a new relationship be honest be honest if you have a shady background you know speak on it uh if you're in a situation where you know you can't talk about it you still have to address it to some extent you know at least let the person know so if they're staying around they know all those nitty-gritty and you don't have to deal with the hanky-panky hide and seek as the relationship grows now there's scenarios where people have uh, made arguments that you know how can you tell them this that if they know that you know you love them you don't want to lose them and that's why you didn't tell them you know but <laughs> when they let her find out what do you think will happen that they won't leave you at that point they will still leave you so if it's something that would be that would make you livable they will still leave you the only difference is that they will still leave you but they will probably now curse you for taking them through that you know a hellhole before they found out so you know tell them anyway if you're a guy and maybe you're in a scenario where you did something bad in the past you know bring it up especially if you're seeing a future with this person you know bring it up and you know let them know because it does help the relationship too you know the 
you know, all those little secrets that people keep most of the time, they're the things that, you know, bind a relationship. But more important than that is the fact that you are not leading a lie while you are in the early stages of that relationship. Because, you know, when it later comes out, you know, it's going to hurt your partner. And in most cases, if it's something that big, they'll probably break up with you. You know, so what's the point of investing all this time, all these emotions, all this, you know, money into a relationship that is hanging on a fake thread? You know, what's the point? So tell them already, if they're going to go, let them go on time. It's better. You know, your emotions are intact. Your feelings are intact. They just leave at that time. It can never hurt you as much as if they leave six months later when they find out, you know. So ladies and gentlemen, this is really something that's a no-brainer. You know, whatever your reason is for hiding it, don't. You know, as a guy, you don't have money. Say you don't have money. A girl, you dropped out of school. A guy, you didn't even go to university. Speak on it. Speak on it and let it flow. You know, let the person love you knowing all these things already. In that way, you don't have to deal with it later. So that's it for this one. It's a short one. Uh, if you love this kind of content, please like, share, subscribe, follow. This is CJ from Many Studios. And as always, I'm here to deliver sense.